Hey, um, Joseph, I got a question. Okay, what is it? Do you think that Sarah's mother will ever change her ways about what she thinks of Sarah's new look? Well, I hope so. I mean, at least Sarah has already moved out, right? I guess. But, I just really hope that her mother changes her ways someday. Me too, Katie. Hey guys, what's up? Oh, hey there Sarah. How's it going? I'm doing okay, thanks for asking. Good morning class. You all look great today. I hope you all did your homework. Um, Sarah? I noticed something different about you. What do you mean? I mean, your head is not on your body anymore, and your neck is on fire. Not to mention that you're not even bleeding. Oh. Well, that's because I've turned into a dull lahan. And if you must know, I turned into this by touching a blue flaming crystal. Oh. Well, that was pretty risky of what you did, but I'm glad it didn't kill you. That does it. I am tired of everyone treating Sarah nicely. I'd expect the teacher to get mad at Sarah for being headless like her mom was, but no. I just have to be the only bully here. And for that, I'm gonna destroy the entire school and everyone she ever loves. Grace, if you're about to shoot up the school, then hand over your weapons. Who said that I was starting a school shooting, when I'm actually doing this? What the? Nobody told me that she can do that. Wait a minute, I think I saw dragons before, and I know what they do. Please don't tell me that Grace is gonna burn the whole school up. Oh no, the school is on fire. I need to get out of here. Man, that was really scary and unexpected at the same time. Did anyone knew that she can transform into a dragon? No, I didn't know that. Me neither. Well, I knew that she can turn into a dragon. Wait, what? How do you know about her turning into a dragon? Well, Grace is my sister. Although, we have different abilities and different personalities. Grace is a dragon spirit, and I'm a shadow spirit. Although, I know that Dol Lahans have abilities. Maybe you can use one of them on her. Wait, you mean to tell us that Sarah Sigrid has abilities now that she's a Dol Lahan? Why yes, yes, she does. This day just got better than I thought it would be. But wait, what ability do I even have? Well, you have an ability that is called telescopic vision. And what is telescopic vision? It means that she can see things that are as far away, like what a telescope sees. Well, I think I will give it a try outside. Okay, so how do I do this ability that you talked about? Well, just hold your head out and focus on who or what you want to zoom in on. Um, okay then. Okay, I can see that Grace is nearly above us. You see? You're doing good on your first time, is there anything else? Oh wait, wait a minute, she's charging in closer. Sarah, I think it's best if you stand back and let me handle this. Yeah, good call. Alright sister, it's time to go down in style. Oh my goodness, are you okay? I did my best, 
but she's too smart for me. Well, I see her charging towards us. Looks like I'm gonna get another bullying problem. What on earth was that yellow robot? Um, I'm not sure, but it transformed into a yellow car and drove away. Something tells me that wasn't an ordinary robot. Oh my. Principal Bringley, are you okay? I, I think so. But anyway, which one of you set the school on fire? It was Grace. The girl with the red horns. Thank you for the detail, Mr. Marvin. Well, I'm glad that you survived, Sarah. Are you okay? I'm fine, Dad, and so are my friends. Also, I discovered an ability that I never knew I have. Wait, you actually discovered an ability? What was it? Well, it's something called telescopic vision. It means you can see things as far away as what a telescope sees, this purple woman taught me that. Wow, that's actually really cool. To be honest, I didn't know the Della Hans can have abilities. Oh, well look who it is. It's the Della Hans lover himself, Barry. I see that you're still visiting that pathetic excuse of our daughter. Monday, what is going on with you? You know you can't say that to our daughter like that. Says the guy who loves Dull a haunts, I bet you love the Headless Horseman too, huh? No, of course not. You are such an embarrassment. I'm not spending another moment looking at your pathetic, Dull a Han, loving, face. Hey, now just wait a minute. Man, sounds like you have a rough mother. Are you okay? Huh? Oh, yeah. I'm fine. She's just going through some things. By the way, thanks for telling me about the ability. Oh, anytime. There's still more abilities that you have, but I'll tell you about them some other time. My name is Dull Doom, by the way. It's really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Well, see you later. Same goes to you, Sarah. <laughs>